Heart disease is the number one killer of men and women all over the world. High blood cholesterol is one of the major risk factors of heart disease. In fact, the higher your blood cholesterol level, the greater your risk for developing heart disease or having a heart attack. That is why an awareness of how our cardiovascular system works and how to lower blood cholesterol is essential. Our cardiovascular system is comprised of our beating heart, blood vessels, and blood. The average man's body contains five to six liters of whole blood. Blood has many life-sustaining responsibilities, including transporting oxygen, carbon dioxide, nutrients, and hormones throughout the body. Blood is composed of red blood cells, white blood cells, platelets, and nutrients. Also circulating in our blood is cholesterol. The two common forms are LDL, the bad cholesterol, and HDL, the good cholesterol. High blood cholesterol occurs when we have a higher amount of LDL than normal. LDL travels out of the blood and is deposited between the smooth muscle cells of the artery. White blood cells called macrophages eat the LDL and become foam cells. These cells eventually rupture and begin to form a lipid layer called plaque. The increase in lipids can cause plaques to grow over time, leading to obstructions. If the obstruction occurs in the coronary arteries, it could result in a heart attack. If the obstruction occurs in arteries of the brain, it could lead to a stroke. There are no symptoms of high blood cholesterol. For this reason, aside from regular screening, we should always keep it at a healthy level to prevent its fatal complications. There are two ways to lower blood cholesterol. First is through therapeutic lifestyle changes like having a cholesterol-lowering diet, physical activity, and weight management. Second is through drug treatment. Unfortunately, lifestyle changes may not always be an easy option for busy people. While prescription drugs are not only expensive, but it also poses side effects like dizziness, allergic reactions, muscle pain, heartburn, and liver damage. Good news! Now you can lower your blood cholesterol the natural way. Introducing Edmerk's Red Yeast Coffee. Red yeast coffee is made from the organic blend of imported premium coffee beans and red yeast rice. Red yeast coffee can reduce levels of bad cholesterol and triglycerides while raising the levels of good cholesterol. Red yeast coffee promotes health of the cardiovascular system, offers nutritional support to the circulatory system, and enhances digestion. Red yeast coffee soothes abdominal pain and invigorates the function of the spleen. Red yeast coffee revitalizes and aids the body's overall rejuvenation as it offers antioxidant and anti-aging properties. Healthy coffee has never tasted this better. Red yeast coffee is another outstanding product from Edmark.